What's up, guys? It's your boy. It's coming at you again with another Madden tip. I'm still out of the 49ers playbook, and I'm actually still out of the same formation. I don't want to beat a dead horse, but the past two videos have been, like I said, out of the same formation. In the last video I put out specifically was one that I kind of exploited emotion. And this, this play is no different. <clears throat> I basically just want to show you that you can, you know, make flood concepts a little bit easier to read and delaying certain things and getting other routes open like for instance <clears throat> we're gonna be going over flood so like i said 49ers playbook gun trio offset <clears throat> and the play is flood so i'll show you what i'm talking about so this play the way i'm gonna do it is actually a really good way to just read that flood side it's hard if if you leave x right there to me i've always had a hard time reading a flood concept um with x there because I just feel like there's so much clutter. Uh, maybe you guys don't feel the same way. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, I've always never really ran a flood play that looks like this. Because I, I thought I always thought it was kind of hard to read. So what the way I'll um, set it up is a way maybe you guys will appreciate. You know, maybe it's fine the way it is for you guys. But it makes it easier for me. So I figure it might make it easier for somebody else. Um, for this specific one, let's just put RB on a block. Leave A for now. You can change that up if you want, but really all you're going to do is motion X over, snap right here. And the good thing is, is it isolates Y on the out route. It takes that, if like for instance, if it's man coverage, it'll take that guy who's on X away and you get a nice one-on-one. -on -one. If it was man coverage <clears throat> and you leave it like this, sure you might make the catch, but you won't get as much rack after the fact so again hit the motion streak the way it delays is very nice just like the last play I showed you he presses he backs up you hit your flat route get 10 yards now I'm fully aware guys that cover 3 Mabel can shut this down this isn't something you're running all game it's just something to throw in it's a concept you can have. So, like, for instance, if you have a wide receiver who's really, really good, but he's not the biggest guy, he can't really get off presses, it's really good to motion him like this because he's not going to get pressed. He just gets a free release off the line. If you know what I mean? I don't know how that cornerback was psychic and just cut cut in front of it like that. If it's man coverage, I don't recommend throwing that streak. That kind of shit will happen. If it was zone coverage, more than likely that streak would never be open. That's why I like it. Because you motion it to the weak spot of a zone. Gets man coverage. You know, if he didn't delay like that, he could have cut it upfield. Run it a couple more times. Flat routes open. Got a first down. Probably man coverage. Try to hit Y again. Blitz got to me a little too quickly. <clears throat> I'll show you can block A too if you want. Yeah, I mean, very simple play. I just kind of want to show you this concept. It's actually, <clears throat> I'm actually incorporating this motion into a lot of my stuff now because I love the free release. I love the delay. It just hit such a nice spot on the field. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm, I'm going to move out of this formation now. I'll go to something else, and I'll show you. Um, Actually, I'm going to stay in the 49ers, but I'm not going to change form. I am going to change formations. Sorry. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like if you enjoyed. Let's aim for 30. It's always a good number. And as always, if you enjoy daily Madden tips, please hit the sub button. Appreciate it, guys.